guys here we go we're right back here with another episode of in the community television this is the entertainment segment of Into the community tv and i'm your host terrence hawkins i'm the duke of comedy and i'm so blessed to be here with a good friend of mine um she's not only lovely she's talented and she is the very funny miss wendy Sebaz. what's up wendy hello how are you good i've been hanging around doing my thing and i know you've been doing yours when y'all see somebody skinnier than they, do you think they should be? Y'all become instant doctors and shit? I'm about to be welcome to be taking my pulse and shit. They be trying to attach IVs and shit to me. Be like, oh, I'm gonna get a transfusion. They be like, this is crazy. Man, how long has it been for you now in comedy? This is year eight. Year, year number eight. eight. Going into nine. You are growing. You're almost about to hit your tenure. Sheesh. How has it been for you? What 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 have been your biggest ups? What is your biggest ups? I won a contest at your club. That was my biggest up. Wow, you did. At you the know bistro. what? You know at the Brightwood Beach though, you came in and you knocked off some pretty heavy hitters too. It was insane. It was crazy. You came in with your A game and you kind of like like shut it down. That's my most proud moment. Honestly. Well, I am so glad that I was able to provide that for you. Um, what she's talking about is I provide um, an opportunity for community comedians to come out and perform against each other and let the audience decide who was the best. I don't believe in a judging system because people can be biased. I have my favorites, you have your favorites, it's what it is. I allowed the audience to decide. And a guy came in with about 40 or 50 people. And you came in, you was just getting off work, and you, you were still in your work, work uniform. Yes. And you, you got on stage and you brought the funny that night, and the crowd clearly saw that you were clearly the funniest person in the room that night. Um... What, what's been your biggest downs? Let me talk. Let's talk about some of the down parts of comedy, because a lot of people that find out that you're a comedian, they're like, "Oh, tell me a joke, tell me a joke," and they don't really know that it's a real major roller coaster ride in comedy. Yes. So let's talk about some of your downs. What's the let's let's go with the biggest one. What has been the biggest down for you in in comedy? I think the biggest down was dealing with my confidence. Okay. And not having. Someone, you know, you can. You, no one can help you with your confidence, right? You know, so it took me a few years. Another thing was waiting on people to help me instead of helping myself. Those are my biggest two downs in the whole thing. Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's something that is important. You gotta be able to help yourself and be willing to to help yourself. Um. Okay. So your ups and your downs let's 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 talk about the very beginning of your comedy who influenced you to go into the comedy realm well i always wanted to be do comedy i've been funny since i was a kid i always wanted to do like you know the big heavy hitters obviously who's who's not influenced by richard dave Chappelle, you know yes. all the the greats now but when i came into the game i had assistance from comics from here okay like um trey elliott who's now in l.a yes. I had a lot of help from Trey Elliott. I've had help from you, Lauren. Mm -hmm. And you and Lawrence Owens. Mm -hmm. uh, Tony Spoon helped me win that that contest. At, at, at the Brightwood Beach Show. Big up to Tony Spoon. Another one of my big time comedy brothers out there doing big things. You're going to be hearing from him real soon. So y'all can stand by. He'll be right here on the couch and in the community. Um, so with that being said, um, I'm pretty sure people are intrigued about how they can follow you or just be involved in what your movement is you want to look into my yeah. camera and just tell the people? please follow me i'm on facebook i'm vet cat and that's v-e-t-k-e-t-t -T. and on instagram i'm also vet cat v-e-t-k-e-t-t -T. but my name my name in the real world is wendy shabazz there you go all right y'all y'all heard it right here this has been another episode of in the community television and i'm your host terrence hawkins the duke of comedy I'll see y'all here.
the next time. You too can follow me at the Duke of Comedy on Instagram and it's all lowercase, all one word. I am Terry D.A. Comedian on Twitter and I am Terrence Hawkins, the Duke of Comedy on Facebook. So please make sure you find your way to like my page, follow my page, and just be connected to what I got going on. And until then, keep it in the community. This has been the entertainment segment of Inner Community Television. Tech, lucky for you, that's what I